you go to the toilet, you are wiping down your toilet. If you brush your teeth, you're wiping down your sink. All of these little things build up and make a house feel grubby. So today I'm on my way to go and visit a client uh, about Home and Castle. So we are going to be getting the house up to a good standard where it can be taken on by a weekly cleaner. Um, so what I do beforehand is I declutter, reorganize. I like to put things in a good flow around the house according to functionality. Um, you know, so if someone likes to work in the front room, create a good little space for work, space for entertainment. You know, each room has a purpose and I like to really utilize the purpose. Sometimes in a house, everything can just kind of get blurred and shit gets moved from one place to another and it can cause that disorganization. And the way this relates to confidence is because once your home is in order, your mind starts to become in order. And once your mind is in order, you can actually focus more on your hopes, dreams and goals. So that is the purpose of home and castle and wow your wardrobe before you go into coaching because it's getting your home in order getting your wardrobe in order so that these things just, just take a little bit of pressure off like steve jobs apparently he wore the same outfit every day and he did it to remove the anxiety caused by the, oh, the old what am i gonna wear scenario that we can all fall into but once you've organized your wardrobe it's easy to get ready it's like becomes more efficient having a color palette knowing what you like to wear having things that you like to wear at on hand so you're not digging through everything is in its place like um, where are you going sorry thanks um everything's in its place and uh, everything becomes easier to just quickly whip it whip it real good you just whip on your outfit and it can somehow still look good you feel good because you've actually put your outfit together and uh, you're just not looking like every other person on road you're just actually going out reflecting the personality and character of who you are so that is why it's important to wear your wardrobe and to get your home and castle in order on the first steps of your journey to wholeness the best bit about home and castle which mums love especially mums that are living with other other, other adults um i.e a man in the house and kids is that with home and castle we put together a cleaning schedule for you so it's not implemented by you it's not implemented by the man it's not implemented by the kids you're not just kind of cleaning cleaning up after people as and when you go the cleaning becomes structured and also there is the option to have a a, a cleaner hired in for you as well um but the cleaning schedule is the golden key um because i actually come and assess the situation i assess what needs to be done who's around what times they're around what actually fits with the lifestyle that you have and the cleaning schedule is then put in place and sealed with the stamp with the agreement of the whole family that like keeping your home and castle um be done all together so that you all feel like you can relax when you get home no one feels like they've got a like cleaning shouldn't feel like it's a burden it should become like a natural part of whatever you're doing so if you're eating you're naturally cleaning up after yourself if you have a bath or a shower you're wiping down cleaning down your shower and toilet if you go to the toilet you are wiping down your toilet if you brush your teeth you're wiping down your sink all of these little things build up and make a house feel grubby. And if all of the people who have the capacity to keep on top of these things are not all doing it and it's just one person doing it, it's gonna cause tension in the house, it's gonna cause stress, it's gonna cause anxiety. And as a mum, you're gonna start feeling like you're losing your goddamn mind. And no one wants that. So we should all be helping mum out around the house. And uh, I'm going to be the one who's going to come in and give you all a cleaning schedule to make sure that happens. Because mummy needs to relax to be the best version of herself for her family. Do you know what I mean? Basically what I for is a So I've just come out of my uh, initial con consultation uh, for Home and Castle with a new client. 
Um, the first area that I tend to focus on um, is the kitchen. So the kitchen, getting that in order, we're gonna get the cupboards cleaned out, organized, um, everything in functionality with what else is in there in terms of appliances. So for example, plates are near where you take you know, take them out from the dishwasher. Um, cups and sugar and coffee is all sort of in a designated area near the kettle. Um, breads, bread bins near the toaster. We're just gonna create a nice flow of functionality in the kitchen first. The second room that we're gonna be focusing on will be the upstairs bathroom, the uh, ensuite bathroom and the downstairs bathroom. Really getting them clean, really getting them sanitized, really getting into all that grime and dirt in the corners, on the skirtings, on the walls. We're gonna be descaling the whole shower um, to bring that nice, hotel vibe feel back into the bathrooms. I wish I had pictures, but not all clients like uh, me to take footage of them, which is fine, each to their own. Um, but I can talk about it, because it's anonymous. So, um, that will be what we'll be doing in the bathrooms. Next, we are going to be renovating the bedroom. Not renovating it, but just giving it a fresh coat of paint, bringing in some more uh, girly elements. It's very clinical at the moment going to make a nice warm feel in the bedroom to create that lady lair and um, she also has a dining room area where she likes to also read so we're going to create a nice uh, reading sort of lady lair area for her in her dining room as well and um, she has a bookshelf sort of little library and we're going to bring in um, a sofa that's kind of floating around and bring it into that room to give her that zone where she could just read have a little reading light so it's going to be really good so that's the initial consultation um, and the first three areas we're going to focus on once we've got through them we might look at uh, the, the detail under the stairs that's you know just covered in shoes at the moment so I really want to get some light under there um, and sort of organize the shoes and organize what she actually uses what the family uses and what they don't necessarily use what are more specialized i.e wellington boots can they be moved outside rather than being used under the stairs because it's creating a lot of mud um, and dirt to accumulate under there um, and then what we'll be doing is bringing in another girl to do a deep clean on the full house uh, so that will be we might even need two girls for that so yeah, all systems go. But yeah, that was uh, that was a really good consultation. So it's 11:26 now, and uh, I've got my morning responsibilities out of the way. Um, filming later on tonight, so I've done my base, my face base, so that I'm kind of getting prepared to be camera ready later on. About six, I need to be full glam, but I'm just building up my makeup during the day. Um, because I actually like it when it settles into your face. So all I've done so far is put my foundation, uh, concealer. I've not even powdered yet because I don't want to powder until I'm actually going to be on screen. Um, so I kind of just build the layers up throughout the day. And I've just put some dark brown just in the corners. I've not done any mascara or anything yet. But you can see that that's already made like a nice little day difference. So that is the day so far. What are you guys up to today? You mum entrepreneurs, what are you up to? Uh, what are your little wins for the day? What are you focusing on? That's why it's important to wow your wardrobe and to get your home and castle in order on the first steps of your journey to wholeness. Isn't it? So if you're into any of all that, just uh, DM me and uh, send me a couple of uh, videos of an area of your home that you want to revamp, renovate or in your wardrobe if you want to have a refresh, you want to start putting your style and your foot forward, I'm all about that. <laughs>